He was running eighth. Going to be dropping back, Don. Indeed he is. I wanted to report something on the uh, 99 car. I'm usually the one down here asking all the questions, but this time the crew came to me and asked me a question. They asked me, where is Victory Lane at Pocono Raceway? Apparently Scott Riggs has never been there. <laughs> He's never been here before either. Uh-oh, uh, trouble. Out of fuel, you see Ryan Hemphill shaking that car, Casey. Yeah, that's too bad. I mean, he had such an excellent run going, and, you know, it's a long lap around here at Pocono, and, you know, hopefully he can get back in time. Can't do it here today. As we talked earlier, big question, was Ryan going to make it to the end? Well, obviously, there's our answer. Not enough fuel. This is a big track to be running out of fuel. Looks like he ran out actually going into the tunnel turn, which is a long ways away. He's yes. actually pulling in. They've got access streets on the back of these racetracks that you just pull in back there and a record will pull you around, so his day's done. One lap to go. Now, you've never won here before. You've never been here before. You're leading, you got a big advantage. But how much is Scott Briggs thinking about, hey, I gotta do everything right this last lap? Absolutely, you know, I mean, he just, the biggest thing he wants to do is bring it home. I mean, he knows Schrader's back there a ways. He doesn't need to push it, just to take care of what he's got. You know, don't be easy on that transmission, just make around these last couple of corners. Scott's a racer, been around a long time. Run, run good in some push races, won some push races. Uh, you know, he, he knows what it takes to win here today, but it's, like Casey says, it's so important in his resume to come here and win in an Arthur Remax race to help him over on the Winston uh, next step up. So, I, think it, I think at this point, you know, for him, it's just really good to have a good run. And then hopefully they learn something valuable today that will help on Sunday. And remember, he started 30th today, so Scott Riggs has had his hands full. But, folks, Scott Riggs is batting 1,000 in Arthur Remax Series competition with his first win. Here at Pocono in his first drop. There we see Ken Schrader finishing second here today. Possibly lost the handle of that race car, but that's better than third. Schrader running up in the bridesmaid role today. Ryan Hempel still listed as third on the scoreboard right now. There's Schrader in that BAM racing Dodge. A good run for that team, and I'm sure they learned a lot that they're going to apply to that cup car tomorrow. A.J. Henderson having a good run here today in fourth place. Billy Venturini, top five for him.